Hey guys, what's up? Jesse D, also known as DJ Necessity. And uh, for a lot of you, you probably haven't heard from me in a while. I've been uh, locked up in the house pretty much since COVID <laughs> kicked off. And, uh, but while I've been locked up, I've been working on a little project that only a few of you guys know, some friends, some family. I've actually been building a home studio in a room that's attached to the garage. Uh, when we bought this house, I had the vision, uh, but it was in rough shape. It was a wor workshop, uh, kind of woodworking, so tons of uh, trash and wood just laying around. It was kind of a mess, and uh, it wasn't finished at all. So, been working hard for I don't even know now, five, six months, it feels like. <laughs> and uh, it's finally to the point where the room is built. And so I'm excited. I'm gonna show you guys what I've been up to. And uh, But first, let's start with uh, the journey, okay? So let's start from the beginning. I'll show you the before and some of the stages, all the things that I've done along the way. And then of course, at the end, uh, we'll have a big reveal for you. All right, cool. So this is what it originally looked like. Now let's flip around and show you the other side of the room. So lots of stuff in there, had to clear that all out. And uh, once I ripped down the walls, this is what it looked like. And once again, I'll show you the other side of the room. Continuing the studio build today, and I'm working on fixing a crack that is in the cement foundation. So uh, let me show you guys what it looks like real quick. So I'm gonna fix that up, fill it in, hopefully it turns out nice. I'm gonna get to work right now and I'll show you guys when it's done. All right, so guys, yesterday I started to install the outdoor unit for the AC uh, by building a little stand and bolting it to the concrete slab that I have. Let me show you. What you doing, buddy? Looks like we've got a little helper. So this is how I bolted down the condenser. And I also had an electrician come out and hook up the power, both to the air conditioner and all the outlets in the studio. All right guys, so today I was gonna come out and start on pulling some of the insulation out and putting in new insulation, but uh, I realized last night that after the electrician came, he hooked up all the outlets, but I forgot to tell him that I was doing uh, two layers of 5H drywall, so I actually need the boxes to be pulled further out. So I've made myself a little template and I gotta go back now, uh, kill the power, pull all those boxes out and set them to the uh, right depth in the wall. So I'm gonna work on that first and hopefully after that I can get some insulation done. So actually the box came out pretty easy. Uh, they're just nailed into the stud there, so uh, that was easy to get off. Now I got my template, let me see if I can find it. So this is my template. I know it's kind of hard to see. It's just uh, pretty much two pieces of wood that amount to uh, one and a quarter inch because that's the depth that I need. So I'm just gonna line it up on the wall here and then pull the box so that it's flush. That's flush right there, it looks pretty good. I think I'll just squeeze them together, tap this nail back in. All right, good to go. Just got uh, about four more of those to do. So just like the electrical boxes that had to be pulled out to uh, make room for the two layers of drywall, I also had to pull out the light boxes, which uh, the electrician just put in. So I had to pull these actually all the way out and get new ones that fit between the rafters. Maybe I can show you guys a picture of what those look like real quick. Um, so I had to pull all the wires out of them, put the new boxes up, put the new the wires back through, and then adjust it to the right height to uh, so that it would fit the two layers of drywall. So uh, yep, just another step. Had those had to go. It is finally time to start working on insulation. Here's a quick look at the room before, and I'll show you guys a quick look after. All right, so currently all the insulation is done 
except for the windows I've been kind of waiting on those because I got to put uh, boards over the windows then I'll put insulation behind it and I'm just waiting because it's nice having that extra light in here while I work um, but right now all the insulation is done all the way on the ceiling and let me see if I can widen up here for you guys there we go so yes uh, much better yay the drywall arrived Here's a shot of the brand new door, just picked it up and uh, right now I'm working on fixing the opening. Let's turn around here. Okay, so here is the opening. I just have to widen it, get it all set so that that door can fit inside. All right, I got my very first wall of drywall done. Now I just gotta keep pushing forward. So guys, it's been weeks and weeks and weeks of hanging drywall, weeks and weeks and weeks of mudding, taping, sanding. It's been awful. I never imagined it was gonna be this difficult or take me this long, but finally the drywall is done and I can start painting today. It's very exciting. Uh, let me show you uh, where I'm at, all right? So as you can see, not only did I get the painting done, but I got the lights in, the AC in, and some carpets put down. I finally got the door in. 